here we have um, our first kick up. So she's in a short down dog, bringing the uh, shoulders over the hands and elevating the hips. Uh, I try not to have someone look too far forward because it creates um, not the best alignment in the pose. So where you want to look is the, you know, the thumbs or the heel of the hand is a good spot to start with. I mean, if you have to look at the fingertips or beyond, it's okay to start, but it just kind of creates a bad habit. So you can see how she's looking forward and then that kind of brings an arc to her back. So these are alter, alternating kickups. Um, and I like these because it's a very good way to condition someone. So if someone's calm and relatively strong and you know enough flexibility, you can alternate kicking the legs up and for because it's a flash that you're up, which I like, and then you come down and it builds coordination and, and then over time, then the holds could be longer or the repetitions could be longer. You could shoot for anywhere from two to five, but it's a, it's a good way, especially if someone couldn't really hold like a handstand for 30 or 60 seconds. Sometimes that's taught. It's just like go up and hold it. Um, I like these because it'll help build up better strength coordination.